inside. You know, the, 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 the spirit that Jake in and you know with these women, you know, they don't understand, you know, why these women why these women doing the things that we're doing because the most I the most I using these women to destroy destroy you dumb niggas. Yeah. Because we, we, we turned away from the most I and went down to other other gods. Right. You understand? So the most I that's um using using the the woman as as a vessel of destruction. Right, and before we carry on, you just introduce yourself. As, um, I'm Daniela. I'm Yawada. Oh, wow. I'm Bella Gorasham. I'm Bella Cora. I'm your brother Nakamia. Right? Yeah, so the most I just talk about because my guys. Um, he must for an, um, start from six. Right, but he pointed him for a seven, you know. Because when we when we came to the sanctuary, Yah Bashem Yah we understand this woman is our enemy. Huh. You know she opposes our authority as men. You understand why that happening? Because like I mentioned, we we sin against our power. The Most High married us through a through a contract. You understand? And we we turned away from the Most High and went after the gods. So the Most High turned our glory against us. Huh. You know. Amos chapter four verse six. And I also have given you cleanness of teeth. So like um, um Hosea. So like, yeah. But there's a, there's a beautiful one too. So like, yeah, Hosea. Hosea chapter 4 verse 6. Yeah. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Yeah, the most I said my people. Which is which is you Israelites, you so-called Negroes, Latinos and Native American Indian. You know entry not entry not being destroyed every day. And why they being destroyed for lack of knowledge? You know, they die from all kind of plagues. You know, they being they being they being gone down. Huh. Right? You understand the the, the the woman the woman caused them to be locked up on child support. You understand? Huh. The woman caused them to be put to death. Because was a cause of lack of knowledge. Go ahead. My people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge because thou hast reject knowledge. Yeah. I would also reject thee. Yeah. For thou shalt be no priest to me. Seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy God, yeah. see, I would see also thou forget thy children. Right, seeing that, that thou hast forgotten the law. Because people on this land have totally forget, forget the most high and, and, and his laws. Good. Right? So they're walking around with, uh, so uh, lawless. Good. To go with the eternal laws, you don't, you don't need to keep no laws. Good. Just want to live lawless. She the most I say what? Eh, I take away your glory from me. Good. Which which is the, the woman? Right? Okay, somebody could get um, uh, Amos. Let me Amos Isaiah 1. I start at verse, um, I think it's 19, uh, verse 20. Because you better say they're walking around here with no, with, with, without no law, you know. It's, it's, only, it's only lawlessness. Good. Yeah, the sun is lawlessness with these people out there. This is Isaiah 1 and 19. If he be willing to begin, he shall eat the good of the land. But if he refuse to rebel, he shall be the power of the sword. And that's exactly what's going on. If he will be obedient, he will eat the fat of the land. Jake not eating the fat of the land. Huh. Jake is just coming the earth. I know. Right now, Jacob at the, at, the, at the bottom and, and telling himself he he good. You know what I mean? He he satisfied with what he get. Good. Who eating the fatty land? These heathens. You understand? Go ahead. Huh? For the mouth of for the mouth of your heart spoken it. Yeah. Yeah. It's it, it, it spoken through the, the, the um, through the prophets. 
Come out of your house. I've, I've spoken it. And what we do, we come out here week after we telling these people, hey, y'all are going off. Done. And what they do, what they, do? They, they, they reject it. Done. You know? Hey, Jigs, hey, Jigs, will be seeing all kind of thing happening to them and still will turn back. Yeah, they don't consider, they don't, they don't look, look, they see why, why it is, why it is happening to me. Christopher, Jeremiah 13, 30, like Jeremiah 13, verse 15. He say, Why Christ thou for thine affliction? Thy sorrow is incurable for the multitude of thine iniquity. Yeah. Because thy sins will increase, I have done these things unto thee. The iniquity didn't increase. Good. So what? Uh, most I tell them the destruction. That's right. Scripture say, he say iniquity shall increase and the love of many shall wax cold. Wax cold. They will be seen. No, we will. When they look at Jesus, they just walk around. They have no love for each other. You know? <laughs> Stand up cursing out, cursing out each other for, for hours. You know what I mean? They no longer have no love for each other. Yeah. Well, against the other nations, they, they, they will never do that. You, you see that going on amongst the self. They're fighting up amongst the self. Continue the eyes here. They're already bitter the eyes here. Yeah, because Jake, Jake's don't want to follow no order. Yeah, they don't, they don't, they don't, they don't like all that. We do constantly say we have to get together. You know? Ten. How is your faithful city become a harlot? How is your faithful city become a harlot? The faithful city is the, is the train of Israel? Hey, Jesus. Uh, yeah. They become a, what, a harlot? What's a harlot? You understand? They, they're running from God to God, culture to culture, doctrine to doctrine. That's how they become. They become like these, like these heathen, they become like beasts. They don't want no Lord, they want to live like the heathen. God. That's why the most I said they're going to be devoured by the sword. Go ahead. God. How is your faithful city become a harlot? It was full of judgment. It was full of judgment. But now, Lord on the way with. The faithful city was full of judgment. We should judge. Yeah. So judge righteously. Exactly. No, no, everything. Everything going and it will be that way. They have no judgment now. Yeah, they become beasts. But the most I call them brute beasts. Yeah, but they, they would see something like that. You're not supposed to judge. But every day you judge it. Yeah, everything. <laughs> you everything, out, everything out of course. Like when you watch the movie um, Avenger and Verb, what Tano say? You're going to bring back everything in its rightful order. Exactly. That's what Yahweh Shai is going to do. Uh, I bring back everything balance. As it should be. You know? Don't you? Yeah. Righteousness lodged in it. Righteousness, no, righteousness was lodged in it. Was it righteousness? The laws? Okay. Yeah, okay. the son? The law, the righteousness was lodged and it was the laws. Yeah. You understand? But now what? Murderers. Murderers. We see go down at Trinidad Tobago. Murderers. Murderers. Women going to the abortion center and committing murders and walking free and boasting about it. Niggas on the black killing the brother and boasting about it. They're singing songs and making about, yeah. about killing themselves. You understand? Boom, boom. <laughs> Blow out your eyeball. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Now it's murderers. Evil. These, these pastors, they are murderers. Can. We can't do this. They lean the flock astray. And when the flock and empty the flock, they're going to be destroyed. Can. You understand? These leaders, they are murderers. They can't lead in the flock astray. Now they lean upon, uh, uh, upon Rasta and, uh, uh, and Muslim. Killing off each other. Not knowing it's, not knowing it's the same people. Are they killing, are they killing off? Yeah. Are they killing off all their own armies? Yeah. Where that? Thy silver has become just. Thy that, wine mixed with water. Thy silver has become just. The silver become filthy. 
You know, we grew up, you have a silver chain here, wait a couple, couple of weeks, you don't know, clean it, just get black. You gotta go, you gotta go take toothpaste now, go in the bathroom, Scrub it out rub the toothpaste and clean it. So that's how, this is how the nation of Israel become two third. They become like dross. They're filthy. And they mix the wine with water. You understand? The wine, wine represents what? The doctrine? The doctrine. You understand? The doctrine water down. The doctrine water down. Love is love. You know, we all is black people. Okay. You understand? Uh, melanin. <laughs> and woolly hair. Melanin and woolly hair. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead, up. Yeah, have my job, man. Listen. Go ahead, go ahead. The prince. Are rebellious? The prince. The prince is who? The Israelites. Yashara, like he prince of the power. Yeah, the young ones and everything. The prince are what? Rebellious. Rebellious. What did the scripture say in um, Samuel 4, Samuel 15, or what? 22? Rebellion is, rebellion is the sin of witchcraft. Can't now let's look at them to the rebellious prince. Yeah. Totally off. For Samuel 15. Yeah. There is a wipe of my 15 chapter. You 15 chapter wipe out? Yeah, this is that. Well, that. They bring it out of there. Are they there for Samuel 15 and, and start 20, 21 or 22? Samuel 15. Samuel 22, say. And Samuel said, Hanya Howell has great delight in going to offer and sacrifice it. Yeah. As in obeying the voice of the Howell. Yeah. Who obeys but that and sacrifice. Yeah. And he is hearken than the fat of rams. For rebellion is as a sin of witchcraft. For rebellion is as a sin of witchcraft. And everything is written. When the most I said, the most I said, put a witch to death, I suffer, and suffer not a witch to live. Okay. And this is the most I can do, these rebellious prince. You understand? You're going to put them to death. For rebellion is a sin of witchcraft. Go ahead, huh? Stubbornness is as iniquity and idolatry. And stubbornness is as iniquity and idolatry. And all of these are transgression to death. Yeah. Now this we're gonna have this we're gonna have to the prince, the prince them. They are rebellious. You understand? They always want to unite. We want, we gotta unite. But each and every one have a different doctrine. That's confusion. The only way you can unite you gotta be on the same on the same mind. Yeah. You gotta speak the same thing. And that's power. You understand? Um, right? What you see? Uh, hey. no. What you see is like, hey. Hey, when, hey. Every man will to be, the own. This will be the answer and must get a blue. Good. Right? Hey, so when you're reading um, hey, Deuteronomy 21, start at verse 18. He say if a man have a stubborn and a rebellious son, which will not obey the voice of his father or the voice of his mother, and that, when they have chastened him, will not happen unto them, then shall his father and his mother lay hold on him and bring him out unto the elders of the city and out and unto the gate of his place. And they shall say unto the elder of the city, This is our son. Is stubborn and rebellious, he will not obey our voice. He is a glutton. And, and a drunkard. Mm -hmm. And all the men of the city shall stone him with stones that he die. Right. So shall thou put evil away from among you. And all Israel shall hear and fear. But there's only Mosai can do. They do the Mosai doing. Right? Disobedient training. Mosai wiping them off. All this great evil that you all see in your abortion, you're shy doing that. And the scripture, I think, is in is the most three six. Um, shall a trumpet blown in the city? Three and seven. Go ahead. Six and seven. Yeah, yeah this is the most, the most size who bring this evil on them because this, this the works, the works is evil. 
Amos chapter 3 verse 6 Shall a trumpet be blown in the city And the people not be afraid Shall they be evil in a city mm -hmm. And you how about Hashem Yahweh have not done it yeah. what's, wrong, what's wrong going on with the, the incident with, the, with um, Sandman and all these all these all these killing in these different areas the most I have called it the most evil Tiffany people's manifest today or yesterday people it's like a crazy joke man that show people are more of the book we don't believe the media though you know the media the media have, the media you know the propaganda machine is the any day they always gotta look good though that's why when I do a video, I think it was two days ago, I asked the, I asked the Ministry of Health, what about cigarette? What about pharmaceutical pills? Because you went to destroy two, 20, $225 million in, in, in ganja and cocaine. And you was this, this, the, 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 the police ministry, the, uh, ministry of Health on a, on a pedestal. Oh, it was supervised by the Ministry of Health. Okay. You destroy the marijuana, you destroy you destroy the cocaine. What about what about these soft drinks? What about these abortion centers? What about what about can what about all these the this styrofoam plastic? What about fluoride in the water? Once it is monitorized and, and controlled by them, it's okay. They were saying, you understand? <laughs> they bring out those advertisement all cigarettes so bad and think why didn't destroy the cigarette? That's what's saying. That's why the right. most I say they 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 take they take bribe. Right. Yeah, they say. Hey, they just say Jake so foolish. If you saw you paint on the box smoking dangerous the hell. Right? And yet they be still foolish, they're still going at smoke. Hey, the most I call them a hypocritical nation. Yeah. The lack of understanding. Ah, but give me um Syrac Syrac seven and one. Gary Brother was talking about these niggas out there. Right? But it's gonna say, shall shall a trumpet be blown in the city and the Lord and people and the people not be afraid? Shall they be evil done in the city and the Lord not done and the Lord the Lord had not done it? Hey. Why the Lord bring it evil? See I'm gonna say something, huh? Yeah. So hey, so they're gonna see great judgment, hey, they're gonna be uh eh, most are gonna put you fear in them. They're yeah. gonna fear him by force. Yeah, they're gonna they're learn, gonna learn to fear him. They're gonna learn the both sides of him again. Because they're gonna know if what is that now nah, something causing this death. No, they're gonna know. They're gonna know. They're gonna know. Because the most I said they're gonna call on it. They're gonna call on him, but he's not, he not gonna answer them. They're gonna know. Yeah. They're gonna know. You understand? Yeah, they will learn to fear him. Go to Israel. That's why Allah Pastor Gobar said, if war don't teach, adversity will. Seven or one. Yeah, give me this here. Yeah, they are going on. Chapter seven, verse one. Yeah. Do no evil. Do what? Do no evil. Yeah. So shall no harm come unto thee. So these niggas out there doing evil. They doing evil. That is plain. The most I said, do no evil. So shall no harm come unto thee. If you out there killing your brother, selling your brother crack cocaine, you there, you you popping your brother woman. You understand? You went out there going to commit a, commit murder at this abortion center. You're, you're taking the man's seat from him, right? And you're putting the man on child support and you're putting him in prison. This is evil they're doing. The word evil means misery and distress. You're bringing misery on that man. You're putting it through distress. Likewise, you niggas who killing the killing your, your own brother, you're bringing misery on the father of the of the of the of the of the individual or the mother or the family member, you bring misery on them. You bring sorrow on them, you're doing evil. That's why it's going to be said, do no evil, and no harm shall come unto thee. You understand? It's evil these niggas doing, and these women doing continually. You understand? Go ahead, Ak. Depart from the unjust. Yeah. And iniquity shall turn away from you. Yeah, depart from the system. Depart from these heathens. Depart from even two toward our own people because they're unjust. They unjust. You gotta depart from them. Go ahead, Ak. Say, my son, so not upon the furrows of unrighteousness. Yeah, don't, don't, add, don't, don't, don't follow the ways of the society. They're sowing, you're sowing, you're sowing on the furrow of, of unrighteousness by taking part of this custom in this in, the, in in Babylon. 
We can wear shoes where you go rip. So go ahead, up. And thou shalt not rip them sevenfold. That's, that's straight to the point. That's straight to the point. You understand? But Israel is a stiff naked people, so they're going to learn the hard way. You understand? You anything know with it? Yeah, go ahead. Up. Isaiah chapter 5, verse 20. Yeah. Warn to them that call evil good and good evil, that put darkness for light and light for darkness, that put bitter for sweet and sweet for bitter. Warn to them that are wise in their own eyes and prudent in their own sight. And there's our people. Good. Turn. Um, by following their own ways. Turn. Yeah. Become vain. Corrupt your way. Most I said to become a degenerate. How 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 most I see plant he plant the noble vine. But now uh, you have become what degenerate? You yeah, understand? Yeah, anything else? Eh? And this we're gonna this, this, this we're gonna happen to you 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 degenerate somebody give me uh, Jeremiah 16 or what? This is gonna happen to you, you degenerate. Where is it on? Good. Jeremiah chapter 16 verse 1. Yeah. The word of the Lord came up also unto me, saying, Thou shalt not take thee a wife, neither shalt thou have sons or daughters in this place. Yeah. For thus said the Lord concerning the sons and concerning the daughters. That are born in this place. Yeah. And concerning their mothers that bear them. Yeah. And concerning their fathers that begat them. Yeah. To this land, they shall die of grievous death. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Huh? They shall not be lamented. Yeah. Neither shall they be buried. Mm -hmm. But they shall be as dung upon the face of the earth. Yeah, like like dog dung, cow dung. That's all they're gonna be. Yeah, the sun. You can see dead body in every 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 step you make is a dead body. Men, women, and children. Go ahead. And they shall be consumed by the sword. Yeah. And by famine. Yeah. And the carcass carcasses shall be meat for the fowls of heaven. Yeah. And for the beasts of the earth. Yeah. For thus said the Lord, Enter not into the house of mourning. Neither go to lament or bemoan them. Yeah, don't even cry for these niggas and these bitches. Most I said, don't enter into no house and, be, and mourn, lament and bemoan them. Go ahead. For I have taken away my peace from this people, said the Lord Yahweh, mm -hmm. even loving kindness and mercy. Most I take away peace, loving kindness and mercy from these people. So these people are going to be destroyed, these people are going to be consumed. By the anger Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. You understand? They kind of doing evil. They're doing evil. And they refuse to take heed. They refuse to take correction. They said that not all the most high counsel. So what the most I can do to you niggas. You understand? So with that, you want to give our praises. Well, to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh, by Hashem, Rakakadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders who rule with that great little stone. Uh, and a blessed salutation to the Akyums and the folk on the earth, pushing the gospel in sincerity and truth. Uh, Say Shalom.